Okay, let's take a start with your IELTS speaking test. Do you work or study? Uh, actually, I'm a working woman. I'm working as a nurse in an international hospital. All right, good. Let's take a start. Are you interested in architecture of different buildings? Um, actually, uh, I'm not interested, but I have little information about architecture because my husband working as an architecture. My husband is working as an architect. Yes, my husband is working as an architect uh, in Saudi Arabia, and he um, build, uh, he work uh, in buildings and uh, he works with buildings. He works with buildings and in construction. Contracts, yes. Okay, do you live in an old building or a modern one? Actually, um, I'm uh, before I'm living in an old building, but before uh, I used to live in an old building, past tense. Okay. Before I'm used to. Live, I used to live. I used to live in a old building. In but an old building. In an old building, but in these days I changed my accommodation and I um, bought um, accommodation near to my hospital. That is an a uh, new building. All right. What sort of building would you would would your dream home be? Um, actually, I cannot understand. Now. What sort of building would your dream home be? Say, my dream home would be a multi-story building. It would be a modern building with all the modern facilities yes, like that. Yes, I want. Uh, I want my dream is. Um, uh, dream home. My dream home is a. Uh, approximately two canals uh, uh, two canals house or uh, building uh, I don't want uh, multi uh, floors because uh, I must I have a single family so I just want to stay in a, a single story okay if you were an architect what sort of buildings would you design if uh, I would be a um, Actually, this is not my field, but if we, I would select this field, I, I would make a different uh, structures like, uh, um, because in these days, every person have... Uh, every person has. Has different ideas and want to see the uh, different and um, uh, unique things. So I, I would make different and unique Unique buildings. buildings. Okay, yes. now let's move on. Speaking part two, describe a building you have seen that impressed you. Any building in KSA or anywhere that you saw and that building impressed you. So you will have to speak on this topic for one to two minutes, okay. please. Actually, after um, after a long uh, tallest building in the world of uh, Dubai, Saudi now become to made a new building that is the tallest building of the world, and uh, uh, that is near to our uh, city. So uh, at the weekend, um, uh, me and my family visited that building to saw the uh, pro uh, saw the to uh, see the to see the um, all uh, to see the system and uh, working uh, criteria of that. Uh, building. My husband actually related with this field. My so husband is related to this field. Is related to this field, so he uh, informed me and he guided informed me. me. He informed me and guided me. The guided me. Guided me the procedure of uh, wor working uh, uh, in that place. He uh, described me the um, uh, system and, and the steps of uh, 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 build up that uh, building. That is very beautiful and very um, modern and very... Okay, thank you. So mainly it's a good idea to focus the building and talk about the building that has been constructed already. If the building is under construction, it's not appropriate. Okay. Talk about something which is already there. Okay, now we move on to speaking part three. Do many people in your country visit historic buildings? Yes, from outside, from in, uh, uh, foreign countries, people like our historical buildings like Shahikila, like um, uh, uh, Yadgar, because dead buildings are... Uh, constructed on uh, historical points like uh, uh, our uh, country uh, independent day like uh, and other our historical uh, uh, historical uh, personalities like uh, basha akbar noor jahan uh, sorry um, uh, okay so it's yes, better to talk about one to two places with a little detail and okay. that's fine and avoid using badsha for king, okay, king like that okay. yeah all right uh, why do people visit historic buildings? Because now we are m more far away from the books. We are uh, totally uh, depends on mobiles. We depend on mobiles. Depend on mobiles and we are far away from historical books. So when we... Um, 
visit any uh, historical buildings or people visit any historical buildings they took uh, many information about that building and about their history okay so mainly you're making mistakes in grammar tenses you're confusing present and past together uh, but still looking at your overall performance i'll give you six band your weak area is grammatical range and accuracy okay. right thank, thank you, you.